Every day begins with birds. Every day ends with birds. Yes, everyone knows about big animals like whales and mammals, but they don't really think about the birds. They take it for granted. If you think about how the small animals and how much they contribute to our environment, you'd be really surprised. Caribbean birds play many critical roles that enrich our ecosystems and economies. They pollinate plants, spread seeds that grow into new trees and forests, eat animals that humans consider to be pests, and clean the environment by scavenging. We have been through a session from Monday and now we have been in the fields on Friday. Today was a fun day. Um, I was really close to nature today. I saw a lot of birds, about 27 birds. At Birds Caribbean, we are really excited to have started the first ever long-term research project to assess the knowledge, attitudes, and behaviors of youth towards nature conservation in the Caribbean. In 2014, over 200 Jamaican students from seven high schools spent two days with bird experts from Birds Caribbean and the Smithsonian Migratory Bird Center. One day in the classroom with presentations, activities, and discussions, and then one day with hands-on experiential learning in the field. What I really liked today was seeing all the birds and how you set up nets to catch them without harming them any of them. And when you catch a migratory bird, how do you ban them? with their numbers. My high point of this field trip was when I got to use the binoculars to see the birds from afar. We identified about 27 different birds, including four endemic ones. We have even learned about the organs of the birds that even we can test it for ourselves to see if the birds are healthy. We gave out questionnaires before and after each workshop, did interviews with the students, and will be following up with them in one and three years. I enjoyed this day because I was able to identify different birds without the help of a teacher or an adult although we were supervised very well. I like when I, t when I got to hold the birds in my hand and feel the way that they feel and their feathers. What people believe about nature and wildlife is not hard-coded into our genes. Instead, it is what we have been exposed to in our families and culture. So, it is possible to alter our beliefs and attitudes towards nature through education. I intend to spread this information that I've now gained by starting a birding club at my school, telling persons in my community, and overall just be more appreciative of them. At Birds Caribbean, we know that birds have shaped human cultures and inspired creativity, science, and engineering for thousands of years. Birds are all around us in the Caribbean. They are colorful and interesting to observe and can awaken people's hearts and minds to notice, learn, and care about ecological systems and become environmental stewards. And I learned how important they are to our environment and how they help us to know what's happening with our climate changes and conditions. And I learned a lot about the sea and the coastal erosion. I've learned many things, for example, we're not supposed to make a lot of noise around the bird because it will scare them. We should be very gentle with birds because they also have feelings like we do. The most important le lesson I learned is that to conserve our forests to save the lives of birds. 
Birds Caribbean is a vibrant international network of members and partners committed to conserving Caribbean birds and their habitats. We raise awareness, promote sound science, and empower local partners to build a region where people appreciate, conserve, and benefit from thriving bird populations and ecosystems. Please join us and support the work that we do. I just enjoyed it and I hope you would come again.